We got the Heritage Glen Hyperlite 19 RBHL here. Very small, compact trailer. Uh, dry weight on this guy's 4,788 pounds. Uh, cargo capacity of 2732. Uh, almost half the half the dry weight. Um, overall length of this guy from the uh, tongue all the way to the back bumpers: 23 feet 6 inches, 11 feet 2 inches tall. Got a huge fresh water tank, 49 gallons. 32 gallon black water, 62 gallon gray water, a lot of tank size on this smaller trailer. We got the corner bathroom in the back, but very compact, small trailer. All right, we got the Heritage Glen Hyperlite 19 RBHL here, uh, one of my favorites. Um, so you got the uh, solid front cap, four sided aluminum construction build on this guy. Two, two propane tanks up here, space for two batteries power tongue jack, all that standard. Um, then we'll move around here to the pass-through storage. This unit's not huge, but you have a ton of storage underneath here um, that you can see just great aluminum construction and uh, plenty of places to uh, put things. All right, you got the side, the campsite here. You got your TV hookup uh, with all your connections, a dog latch here. Um, becoming very popular on these travel trailers. Outside speakers obviously have the accent lighting. A uh, huge awning that goes up top, pretty much the full length of the trailer. All right, first thing you notice when you walk into this unit is gonna be the huge pantry. So you got your glass insert door and plenty of storage right here for things in the kitchen. Um, right next to that, you don't have to go too far to get to the 12 volt 11 cubic foot fridge it's gonna run right off your seven pin going down the road that way you don't have to worry about keeping your food cold moving forward here into the kitchen we've got your Furion microwave the three burner range top nice decorative backsplash smaller oven like I said it's pretty standard on most units and uh, a little drawer underneath for your pots pans very similar to what you got at home larger residential faucet you got a dual sink here so plenty of space to wash your dishes a lot of storage in this guy as well glass inserts on the cabinets you got your radio here so this is again a dual zone so you can go inside, outside with it. Uh, you see here, you got zone A, zone B. One's inside, one's outside. Plenty of storage here along the kitchen area and plenty of countertops space, even in this smaller unit, which is kind of hard to find in a lot of travel trailers. Moving here to the front of the coach where we have the master bed. Um, there's no, no divider here. But this is a couple's coach, so not a big deal. You got wardrobes on either side here, as well as overhead cabinets for more storage. And then actually behind uh, the wardrobes, you'll see that there are outlets and there is a space. Uh, you know, if you wanted to put a CPAP or whatnot, there is that space there on either side of the bed. Uh, to charge your phones, run the CPAP, whatever it might be. Um, and then you have underneath the bed, you do have a little bit more storage. Now this is separate from the pass-through storage, which is nice. It's gonna keep it a little more insulated and uh, you can access it from right here. All right, we're here in the slide out. This is the residential theater seating um, that Heritage Glen does. So you got an outlet right in there that way you can charge your phone as you're watching TV. Um, a lot of people they are concerned about where to eat. Well, this actually comes with a hookup there. Basically, just slide the table right in there, and you're good to go. So you got your kitchen table that hooks right in. Um, let's see. You do have accent lighting in the cup holders, and then you got your roller shades on the back there. Um, these can be controlled individually. 
if you want it to. So this bathroom here is right when you walk in the door. Um, you got your toilet right there um, with plenty of counter space here in the bathroom, the medicine cabinet, a couple towel, hook, towel hooks, um, a ventilation fan there up top. Moving over into the shower, you do have a little ledge there that you can put stuff on um, in a nice residential style. Uh, shower head, plenty of space there um, with the skylight gives you a little bit more light and one of the coolest things about the Heritage Glens is actually the shower curtain so it's not a standard plastic curtain it's actually kind of an upgraded curtain um, makes it a little more uh, modern this is Micah here at RV Wholesalers uh, we just walked through a Heritage Glen Hyperlite 19 RBHL um, so if you guys have any questions on this unit or uh, would like to order one, maybe take one that's in stock, we got one, uh, give me a call. My number here is 937-649-5632.